As the teams and drivers prepare for the final tarmac test of the year, Rally Spain provides them with one extra challenge. Switching from tarmac roads to gravel stages on Sunday means that the cars need to be converted from sleek, stiff, road-going races to higher, softer, off-road machines. Not only does this have to be done on events, but also during Saturday night's 75-minute time-restricted flexi service. Basically, you just change the whole transmission, the whole suspension, so it's quite a lot of work. We do it from, from one weekend to another, uh, so sometimes it's good fun to do it from one day to another. We have to change the conditions quite quickly and uh, it will be uh, the same for everybody, so it will be very interesting to see how the drivers will adapt uh, from, uh, from Tarmac to, to Gravel. In just one hour and 15 minutes, the teams have to change the suspension, brakes, transmission, differentials, steering rack, and of course, bolt-on gravel wheels and tires. It is a massive undertaking, so just how do they do it? In order to save time, rather than unbolt the suspension, steering rack and brakes part by part, the whole tarmac subframe will be removed from the car with the main components still attached and a gravel one slid in and bolted up in its place with most of the gravel ancillaries already on it. The differentials and gearbox are done separately. This is the fastest way to do it. What these boys can do in 75 minutes would take at least three days in your local garage.